welcome our next actor! my tour, I wake up in the morning, I go shave in the bathroom mirror. All of a sudden, my vision just gets real blurry, and it starts to just keep going throughout the day. Yeah, so I'm like, whoa, that's fucking pretty odd, right? <laughs> but it's so freaking hot, it's the desert. I figure just the heat, so I drink a lot of water. See, I was stationed right at the Kuwait-Iraqi border, this major staging ground for equipment shuttling called Truckville. Dude, all kinds of shit goes through Truckville. Ammo, water, MREs, you name it. Now, a lot of times, these ribs are carrying equipment that got destroyed in combat, you know, cassies, uh, uh, shells, tank treads. But the crazy thing is, I would pull duty carrying those rigs, and half the time, I didn't know what the fuck I was driving. <laughs> but you know, it's the Army. You do what you're told to do. My vision, it just kept getting worse. Then I started getting these headaches, man. They were terrible. And it felt like somebody was trying to drive a railroad spike through my skull. I didn't know what to do. I keep drinking water. And then, today, we're going over to Camp Wolf, right? A couple of my buddies and me. Personal shit like toothpaste, foot powder, that kind of crap. Now I got a crave for root beer, so I was gonna get me a case of that. Now I'm driving home on the way back. And suddenly I get this pain in my head so bad that my hands lock on the steering wheel. I, I stop breathing. I look up in front of me, there's like two palm trees, but next thing I know, there's four and there's six and there's eight. And I black out. Now, I remember coming too, right? I'm soaked in sweat. My head is pounding. They're laughing in the back like I'm trying to pull, them, pull off a maneuver or some shit. Dude, we could have all gotten killed. I remember looking up, the last thing I see in the rearview mirror is them two palm trees, man. They all just crushed over me to one side. I'm like, damn, ain't nobody go out there and fix them. A couple of innocent palm trees, what were they doing but just being palm trees? See, that's what got me in here. But I don't want to tell nobody what's going on. I don't want to make no fuss in the army. They don't like no fuss. I'm getting paid real good. And I like being a soldier. I like to work. Shock and Awe, written by Damon DeMario. Wow. 